film that I'm going to be talking about today is my final year film called Milk and I'm going to also be incorporating my first semester film called Inside You. I'm going to be talking about the influences that went into this piece and Inside You. I'm also going to show the examples of their work, showing how they influenced mine. Edgar Wright was a major influence when it comes to the film Milk. The way in which he does quick action montages is what I tried to incorporate in this film. He also edits to the beat. Here's an example of Edgar Wright's work compared to my work when it comes to editing to the beat. Last influence is director Christopher Nolan. His influence is seen through the twist in the story of Milk and Inside You. Both have unpredictable endings, leaving the audience on the edge of their seat, not knowing what's going to happen next. Okay. What the hell? Ryan. When it comes to my development, I think I have definitely improved on my editing skills and techniques. I use a new skill whilst editing the film Inside You. I managed to edit the mirror scene in the film to make the reflection move separately from the actor looking into it. I learnt this technique from a YouTube tutorial that is a simple step-by-step -step guide and process. Here is the YouTube tutorial I used. That up. And what that does is reveal anything outside of the path on the clip below. So if I scrub through you can see now how the effect works. And that's it, simple as that. So what I'll do now is show you the finished version. Thanks for watching. I also learned how to color grade. A good example of this is in the film Milk. The scene is based at night, so I had to make sure the colour was dark enough to be night time, yet make sure the audience is still able to see exactly what is going on in that scene. When it comes to how I've improved specific techniques, the best example I can give is through the film Milk. Unfortunately, the sound quality on the footage was very poor and had a fuzzy sound throughout all the clips. So, when it came to editing, the sound was not up to any standard. I then began editing the sound. I either had to strip the sound off the clip altogether and add sound effects myself. On Thursday. He's been taken into custody and will be questioned by... I also had to add my own sound to some of the clips because, unfortunately, some of the crew members were talking throughout the clip. Therefore, I was forced to add sound effects from elsewhere. And Pope? He's been taken into custody and will be questioned by detectives from the East Coast. With both of these problems amended, I was then happier with how it looked and felt as if I had reached my desired outcome. So, overall, I think my development throughout this process has definitely improved. I have learnt new skills, used different people to influence my work, and have developed new skills that I'm definitely going to use in my future work.